Sterling calls this the piss ditch. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's a camel. Yeah. Dumps over into the area down in there. Those are safety ropes. I don't know if you got that on tape. Right here. But these right here, see where I'm showing my light? Yeah. Those are safety ropes. Okay. And there's a loop back here okay. that hooks onto. And so whenever you clean those out, you're more than a safety rope. Holds the metal and the core backing it up so we can walk past here. Big, one of the biggest uses for lead are batteries. These batteries here have a lot of lead in them. So that's one reason why So each one of those square things is a battery. Yeah, this is a battery, that's a battery back there, and this is a battery up here. Okay, I'm gonna... And you just do that and put the old battery over here, set it down, and move this thing across, get it doing, stick it on the motor. This is, fun. this is called a scanning bar, and it's usually straight. And you see this right here is, is pretty sharp. This is, uh, it should be sharp whenever you turn it down. And whenever you got loose rock, stick it up, pry it down. I know this is the most, you know, intent. I would stick it in there, cut it, pull it down. Now what's important is up here, hold those rocks up there so they don't come crashing down to hit. Yeah. Dump that chute just like that. When you dump it all the way down, it all comes in and fills okay. up. Okay. All in it? Yeah, that's uh, the phone system. Wherever you're, there's a phone, okay, whenever you call, all the different phones can hear it. Oh. You just go like, hello, hoistman, hello, hoistman, or whatever, and everybody can hear it. And if it's to you, then you go answer it. Oh, okay. And then once you answer, it's just like a walkie talkie. You know, hold down and talk, release when you want to listen. So where did that where does that come from that you just this right here goes uh shoot, I mean that, that's a few hundred a, feet up probably. That's from a shaft that they're Yeah, and what it is is way up way way above there's what they call a stope, which has all the muck in it and they're blasting and everything. And all they're doing is up there with uh, you know, little bobcats or muckers that, that they call them. And they just dump it down the chute. Because what it has to do is it all has to come down to the crusher eventually. You know, so the best way to do it is to, you know, just make little shoots like this where you can dump down and take the cars and take the cars to the grizzly and dump it down to the crusher. A little bit better, it's easier. And you stick dynamite on one end of it and then you just keep sticking. How much dynamite do you use? Uh, we used 2.6 last time. And what you do is you tape it to the top of the stick and you shove that stick up there, tape another stick to it, shove that up there. I think it just keeps going higher and higher and higher. Way up the chute, maybe, you know, 30, 40 feet up there. Just how wherever it's stuck, and you stick it up there, and of course you got your uh, dead end fuse on it, or they call it power cord, and then it's run all the way down here, and then you put a, a delay fuse on that, they call it black cord, and you light that, and then you take off down there and wait for a while, and then it hits and blows up, and then you can empty your chute again. And these are muck sticks. Right there's a muck stick. I mean, it's really a shovel, but they call it muck stick. 